Evolution, fact or fiction? Today we delve into the nails of science to find out the truth. Hi, I'm Ryan, and welcome to Controversy Corner. If you like hearing the news but you're tired about being so serious about it, then hit that subscribe button and notification bell. Back in 1856, before cell phones or a reason to live, biologist and baby troll doll lookalike Charles Darwin published a theory called natural selection, which states that individuals with more useful traits have a higher likability to live and reproduce than those who do not. This process reoccurred for millions and millions of years. So if this theory holds true, how do you explain people like Alex Jones? They want to shatter your mind talking about Justin Bieber! On the other hand, creationists, or as I like to call them, the Jesus Squad, believe that the idea of life being directly designed by a deity is just as scientific as evolutionary theory. And we all know the definition of science. The intellectual and practical activity encompassing the systematic study of the structure and behavior, blah blah blah, God did it. Evolutionists cite the fossil record as evidence to show that traits in animals have changed slowly over time to get where they are today, even in humans, as depicted by this diagram showing ancient homos evolving into current homos. In rebuttal, creationists often say that such a complexity as life could not have arisen from such a process and must be the result of intelligent design. But I gotta ask you, is this really intelligent design? Often used as evidence for evolution, comparative anatomy amongst species showing similar bone structure can be seen in apes and humans. However, there are distinct gaps between known organisms. One organism is not observed to change into another. We do not observe this quote, missing link, because there is not one creationists will say. Much like the missing links between the brain stems of some of our national leaders. But what if there's truth in both theories and God's challenge for us is to think big and some of us just simply don't want to do it. Whether you believe that we're the product of millions of years of genetic change and improvement or the envisioned creation of some great deity, at the end of the day, we cannot have a respectful dialogue about humanity and how we got here or where we are going. What do you guys think about evolution? Leave a comment down below. And I'll see you around the corner.